Why are you seeing the spark lens? I mean, from what we see, it's literally just a normal gun that can, you know, be upgraded to a fucking rifle. But I mean, the spark lens literally uses fucking monster based attacks and can lit- and from what we saw in, you know, Zed's failed henshin, you can literally fire Ultraman based attacks from to where why are you using it? Why? Isn't this a fucking downgrade? Okay, so I'm recording in real life to show the fact, you know, prove my point. Okay, so here's my Ultraman Trigger Superior key. Now, wait for it. Work. Okay. You can literally shoot Ultraman based beans. Why are you fucking get rid of this in the show? Like, from what I've seen, it's just a bunch of normal, you know, gun blasts to where, why you get rid of it. So, after that brief tangent, I'm gonna just say that everything else in the trailer has me hyped up. As you know, Ultraman Decker, I'm gonna I'm gonna just say that Ultraman Decker's design has actually grown on me to where I'm actually fine with it now, compared to when I first saw it. As his transformation sequence looks very good, but the engine device's voice still irks me. But I'm gonna just let it slide. As the new guts, you know, the guts vehicles is also something I'm interested in, seeing how it's like direct reference to the guts eagle. As for the casting, uh, it actually looks very great, as especially with the return of Ultraman Zero's host from the Ultraman Zero movie and with the return of one of the cast members from Ultraman Zaga. Uh, as compared to Trigger, I really hope they delve into the characters more compared to what we saw little in Trigger. As I kind of wish they brought back one of the characters from Ultraman Dyna, like Hibiki or maybe even Koda as a way of, you know, that in Diana he was the deputy commander to where now we get to see him as the full-on commander. As onto that, I, re- I really hope they bring on Takeshi Serrano to reprise his role as Asuka Shin in this, compared to how in Ultraman Shikira we did get Tiga back, but we didn't get Daigo back. So I really hope to see Shin Asuka in this, like at least one episode. So other than that, well, maybe a sword, because I mean, it's kind of getting, I feel like it's going to get, repetitive of you know ultraman having weapons but other than that show looks great i hope to see it when it comes out and maybe i'll make a reaction video to it uh, seeing how Subaraya is like you know more lax and compared to toy when it comes to you know people using their stuff uh see you next time when ultraman decker comes out fully